Hello, everyone, and welcome to Moonrise. This is Dave Johnson, and channeling the man on the moon today. I'm on a very important mission to raise the vibration. I was uh, given this task uh, by Spirit a few months ago that today on the equinox, which is, or sorry, yeah, equinox, not solstice, which is the day of half light and half dark directly and 100% on the planet. Today, we're going to raise the vibrations. Ideally, all of you will participate, all of you watching will participate and uh, go through it with us. And as you do, help us to raise the vibration. Uh, I'd like to introduce everybody starting here. With me, this is B. Saye. You can call me B. And uh, if you're interested in what I do, you can look at naturesnarrative.com. And uh, this moment, this precious moment that we have together, I just want to emphasize hypnagogic, hypnagogic. There's that time between sleep and awakeness when you see images or you hear voices. That's the planetary state that we're in now with the equinox. That's why this time is so important for us to step into because this is the twilight. This is the twilight time of the earth when the non-material and the material come into being synergistically. So I look forward to doing this with you and to uh, stepping into our future. Thanks so much, Pete. And my name is Sue. I am a, a light worker, been doing Reiki and many, many modalities for over 30 years because I'm really old. So. <laughs> or I just feel that way today, I don't know. But yeah, I'll be leading the meditation. So this is for um, joining with the earth energies and increasing the frequency for everyone through the vibration. Thanks, Sue. Thank you, Dave. Thank you, everyone, for <clears throat> making this possible. I'm Queen K, and I'm actually here. Uh, I'm guided to be here to share with you the vibrations that we have on this very special occasion. And it's truly a blessing to be able to join everyone in this room, guided by Dave and every beautiful soul here. Thank you. Thank you. Hi, my name is Penny, and I am also very glad to be here. It's a privilege um, to participate in this occasion. And of course, guided by spirit and I'm so, I'm so excited. Um, this is going to be wonderful. So I'm looking forward to this. Thank you for having us, especially me. <laughs> I want to thank all of you for participating in really, really amazing work. Um, I have to say, just absolutely the most amazing work I have ever done is uh, with these four ladies. So Aww. Please, uh, please again do, if you're watching out there, we need and want your participation so that we can raise the vibration. Don't hesitate to uh, become part of what we're doing. Um, go through this meditation with us and add in your uh, own bits and pieces, the own extra parts um, that come from you and your soul, right? Uh, so Sue, can you uh, lead us in the grounding? I will. I'm going to do a short explanation on our intention, just so everybody's very clear. Um, we're first going to be grounding and connecting with the earth energy. We're going to be merging with the earth energy and basically the magnetic field, which is like a heartbeat or a pulse of the earth. So that is uh, particular to this meditation, which is, is joining the earth energy. So having said that, I will begin. So I would like everyone to take a very deep breath. So inhale deeply. And exhale. And once again, inhale. And exhale. One more time, inhale, and exhale. Visualize pulling in the white source light, the universal love light 
through your crown chakra and bring it smoothly and slowly down through your chakras. This is our grounding cord. So force energy through the crown chakra, third eye, throat chakra, heart chakra, third chakra, second chakra, first chakra, and down into the earth. Deep breath in and exhale. Imagine the energy going all the way through the earth. Force energy through the crown, going all the way through you into the earth. Sit in that energy for a moment. Now imagine that energy splitting off right and left going all the way through the earth and coming back around and circling into your crown chakra. Take a deep breath in. And exhale. The energy is going through you all the way through the earth and circling back around just like the magnetic field does, coming back around and through the top crown chakra once again. And just sit in that energy for one moment. And allow the energy to pass through the earth, going all the way through, circling, and coming back down all the way to the crown chakra and moving its way all the way down. Deep breath in. Exhale and expand your energy out as far as it will go from your body. Expand it as far as is comfortable for you. Stretching that energy out. Stretching, stretching. Good. Deep breath in and exhale. And now we're going to shift to the higher dimensional frequency. If there are any guides who are there to contact us with our highest good in mind, with any knowledge we may benefit from, please feel free to step forward and speak. I'm getting a very happy feeling from spirit right now. They are very happy we're participating in this way. Feel that energy continuing to fill you up. Imagine there's a pyramid. If you have any excess energy, and you're feeling uncomfortable, please direct it to the pyramid. Let that fill up with the extra energy. We'll be using it later. And I'm asking all guides and higher beings who have a wish to communicate with us, please step forward. Hmm. Yes, this is the structure of time. You have reached an opening into this structure. The convex, the concave, the pyramid. 
This is our means for connection. Opening, opening, opening. Spirit in the form of an alien is showing me how um, the surface of the earth can really light up. It is lighting up as one person after another does this ritual. It's creating a sort of glow on the planet. Yes, yes these are the nodes, the nodes. I was told I was told we have the tools, however, you have the hands to use these tools. Mm -hmm. mm. Biological entities mm. are capable of vortices within your energy fields. May we ask questions, B? Your microphone. Yes. Yes. Mm. Uh, why? Why is now an important time to do this work? To raise the tears. The tears. There are tears. Your protection. Your fields that cover, enhance the membrane, if you will, what allows you to breathe, not simply with air. There are toxicities that build and must be calmed, released. The means for doing this is resonance, as you call it, sound, sonore, sound, resonance. You may visualize this with energy, colors and fields. You have done so with this meditation. Rest here, come to know this. For this is how we connect, sustain, enliven. These nodes pulse with your heart, each of you has a node and when this resonance comes together as you are accomplishing the pulse beats brighter this is the pulse of source you are source However, this must be acknowledged, conscious, engaged. Mm. 
Hmm. And B or anyone, can you tell us how those watching can help raise the vibration? Be here. Hmm. And now there is this thing you call time. You may engage at any time. More importantly is the space. This is practice. It is always enjoyable to connect. This vision of energies, this is helpful. Colors move through red. to purple, this Newtonian, you call it, the spectrum is helpful. Mm. However, each of you has your own connectivity. The Taurus, this joining of magnetic energies is helpful. The breath, coming into your body, the body of Gaia, your body, the earthly plane of bodies is an important space. Your heart opening onto planet, the lives, living beings, this multitude. Heart connectivity, pulse of life evolving onto splendor, the door is yours. You have only to enter. May we know the name of the spirit with whom we communicate? Aka. Mm, thank you. This door is ajar. Mm. Your vessel. Speak with your vessel. Use your vessel. Connect through your vessel, do not abandon your bodies. This is earth. You are witnessing the abandonment of bodies other than your own perhaps your own. Come to this awareness as the first step across the threshold. We hold you dear. Dearly, dearly, beloved. If only you could love each other as we love yourselves. This is your path. 
This is the uptick. Stepping into love of self and other. Too often this other has been the planet herself. Learn to breathe with her. This meditation, take in the air, down your chakras, Exhale, magnetic, up into crown. Inhale, exhale, whichever is suitable. Root through, down through the earth. Break up and out. Down through up down and through Beauty. Sorry, Queen K, mm. just want to give everybody, uh, uh, please do speak if you feel that um, you've, uh, you've, uh, you've got a spirit online. Sorry to interrupt you, B. No, 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 no. There are many, there are many. Uh, I just wanted to add that intentions are critical for meditation. Mm -hmm. Just simply slowing your breathing, deep breath in, exhale out with your intention of sending love and healing to the earth. It's as simple as that, your intention mm -hmm. to do that. Mm -hmm. Breathe it in and breathe it out. And the love go. Not complicated at all. Mm -mm. Not complicated at all. Yeah. Thank you, Dave. Thank, Thank you, Dave. You. Thank you, Spirit. There's so many of us that has been here before and has come back, but there are a few of us in this room, at least two that I can feel, who like to see that Just giving back energy to Mother Earth when we sit down, when we meditate, and exactly the way that B and Sue has shared, pulsating true energy, just sharing wherever we are, in our rooms, in the park, as we sit on Earth, the pulsating beat through our chakra, just share with Mother Earth. I can see pulsating lights. Just purple, light blue, yellow, orange, red, going up and down through our chakras and into Mother Earth. There is a guide, 
and there is a gatekeeper here, both thanking everyone in the room for bring a, bringing awareness for this simple fact through the universe, sharing our energy. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Big heart is bursting, bursting with such gratitude. Thank you so much. I feel that there is so much of energy in my heart that I just want to share this out. Thank you, B. Thank you, Akka. energies that goes through the crown chakra down around you and circling into you again up and down if we all can practice that in everything that we do we energize everything and everyone around us especially your inner being so that you can make this place a better place we have come before and we have been with you. And we still watch. Just share this teaching. Just teach, just share and get many of us to learn what each of you are doing. And just share the love with Mother Earth and everyone who wants to connect with spirit. Thank you. Thank you. Thank mm. you. Mm. Dave, who are, are you connected to at the moment? Can you say this again, Sue? Who are you connected to at the moment? Uh, it feels, uh, who? It's, um, I'll just say, uh, a little bit challenging because at the same time, I am the producer here. <laughs> I'm trying to make sure all the things work out. I am also... Sue. Go ahead. Sue. Yes. Big Heart is here. The one that pulsates, the one that's very strong, the one yes. that's been here before. Yes. Who's actually shining out this whole pulsating eye mm -hmm. of the seven chakras, I can see red, orange, going up to purple, a strong purple. And at the same time, there is a guardian that I feel there's a female presence here, mm. which is a guardian. And she's sharing the same thoughts. So my triangle is nearly complete. Mm. Big heart is on my left. Gatekeeper is on my right. And I'm guided by the light pulsating light in front of me. Big heart has been here before. And he's still here. Mm. This is a very strong presence. And he is connected to earth. He's connected to the land. And he's watching humanity as it goes. I have a sense that he is like a like a shamanic, like someone who has mm. who has given advice in a very long time before, but he's having this smile at looking at how we are doing it now. Like you know, 
as if you can have this feeling that the Red Indians who are doing their work, as if mm. yeah, their work for Mother Earth, mm. but he's smiling because he says you have evolved to re to something that's beyond what he has seen, but he is amused because everything will come back to the same spot, how he has done it, how we are doing it, and how the future will be doing it. Mm. It is all connected. It mm. is all connected. So much love. Mm. So much love. He likes to show himself to you. Yeah, I'm getting a very strong birthing, birth, birth energy. This, this eye. Pulsating eye. Mm. Pulsating eye with mm. all the color mm. that we have. Mm. And the purple is just pulsating within your third eye. Mm. Mm. And look into that eye. Look into that mm. violet indigo burst of light and it will mm. take you down, down, and down where you need to know. Mm. And this is good. Dave, you need to speak. Uh, so, <laughs> this, uh, you asked who was here, and I see what appears to be a very tall alien being. Uh, so it's sort of um, halfway in, halfway out, and I'm just inviting him. Okay, I'm ready to do this. Now, um, for those of you watching, <clears throat> I have not uh, run to trans channeling. <laughs> I've always been a sort of viewer, but this moment <clears throat> feels very close to absolute trans channeling. <clears throat> I feel like he's entering now. He or she. Mm. Mm. You can't say my name because it is too difficult in your language. But you may call me Omega. I'm here to help raise this vibration through your beings. Mm. A beautiful circle of light is spreading uh, across the globe. It encircles the globe. It encircles even those places where there is great difficulty now. Mm -hmm. All of us, all those watching, can participate in this shift, this change. It truly is coming about. And do not be too distracted by the difficulties of your planet. These difficulties are a consequence only in that they can bring you together. Focus on this togetherness and leave the divisiveness behind for it will do you no good. It's merely a distraction. The divisiveness is merely a platform for unification when you reject the divisiveness and move towards unification, 
you are incredibly powerful. You can focus together. And even if there are just a few of you, you really can raise the vibration of the planet and the universe. All eyes are upon you, not in judgment, but in love. As we watch you overcome great obstacles to rejoin together as one. This is the truth. The truth is one. A good deal of work is required to leave behind divisiveness. Your chemistry and minds are in such a way that this distraction is very appealing. It allows you to fill your days with certain kinds of emotions. However, if you continue in this way, you will find yourself completely worn out. All of the emotions will be spent and you will be left with difficulty. This is a moving away. This is a moving towards the brighter and the higher and the more true. What you experience now in this moment is what we experience all the time. We have empathy for people on this planet. It is difficult, difficult work understanding the emotions. Things happen in physicality which cause great emotion. This is not selfish on your part. It is true, it is real. And through these emotions you learn. However, the time has come to take control. You can take control. You can become part of the one network which raises the vibration. We wish you to continue doing this, continue meeting like this. Again and again, you will experience this beauty. Again and again, you will be able to raise the emotions, raise the vibrations to their purest point where they join again as one. You become disheartened, remember this. You truly are one being. All aspects are reflected in each individual, but they will reflect back the truth, <clears throat> the truth of the one. Thank you. Mm, thank you. Beautiful. Are there any other methods? They are among us. Yes. They are among us yes. who don't speak. <laughs> Yet, a simple gathering such as this, or a big gathering, those among us who don't speak, may have the strongest of the energy that you may mm -hmm. need. Mm -hmm. Those who speak has different energies. So gather them. Gather them in one intention or if your intention is right. That energy from those who don't speak shall wash like waves 
to accomplish that intention. Mm. So gather them, gather them. Mm. They are heard. They are heard. Are you ready to bring this to a close? Knowing we can always return, yes. <laughs> I would like everyone to pull their energy back into their bodies and to take this pyramid you filled with energy and place it on the earth and let it flow back into the earth. Imagine it flowing across the surface of the earth, filling every nook and cranny. flowing smoothly like water over stones. Just putting all the love in that we've collected and let it disperse back into the earth. I would like you to take a deep breath in and exhale. Bring your energy down into the earth and ground in the core, ground deep in the core of the earth. Bring yourself back into your body. You've all been skywalking here, <laughs> space travelers, one and all. Okay. Concentrate on pulling your energy in, disconnecting. I'm disconnecting our heart chakras. We've been linked for this. Feeling energized and wide awake. And back into the body. Hi, Dave. <laughs> Yeehaw. <laughs> that was great. That was wonderful. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Wow. My heart is so full. Oh my goodness. So much emotion, so much gratitude, so much love, just the feeling of just fulfilledness. I mean, the vibrations and the frequency were so high. Um, and I, I would just recommend, you know, that if anybody wants to contribute their own, uh, to this, just feeling the, the vibration of happiness um, and that one intention, you know, but really being positive. That's what really raises that vibration. Just be mm. positive. Mm. Great, great advice. Mm -hmm. And gratitude. Mm -hmm. Yes. That's my, my baseline. Baseline is gratitude. Mm. We're still recording, Corinne. <laughs> blessings, blessings, blessings. Yeah. Wonderful. <laughs> and Dave, you've made your debut. Wow. Yeah. Um, <clears throat> Omega. Yes. I, kind of, I kind of felt like I did that a couple of times, you know, when we did this work before, that was actually yeah. truly my debut. But um Again, I've always been just a little hmm, hesitant to have them come into my body. Um, well, it's nice when you have somebody that can pull you back yet out. Yes. <laughs> yes. What's the container? Yes. Mm -hmm. yeah. 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 Well, of and course, we all want to make sure that we're in a comfortable place to do this work with people who are really helpful. Thank you so much, you guys. That was just marvelous. <laughs> Okay. It's it's trust. It's trust. It's yes. uh, that I think is something mm -hmm. to work with. Mm -hmm. You know, Absolutely. trust. Yeah, establishing your tribe, just one step at a time. Uh huh. Yeah. Right. That's true. Mm. Yeah. Mm. 
Wow, I have tears in my eyes, you guys. I know, I do too. I, do too. <laughs> I believe it's intention. Intention. Yeah. Setting the intention mm-hmm. for there are many of us who has this, this energy within us. Mm-hmm. Unawakened souls, I feel. Unawakened mm. energy that needs maybe being tapped. Mm. And for that, I have so much gratitude. Mm. So much gratitude for, mm. for the powers that be, for the mm. guides that have come to us. Mm. 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 Thank you. Mm. Allowing, allowing this. Mm. Great. Mm. Okay. Gorgeous. Gorgeous. Thank you, Dave. Thank you for enabling this. Thank you guys, thank all of y'all. That was just mm-hmm. terrific. Great. Mm-hmm. Uh, is there anything else before we uh, sign off here? No, just sending you love. Uh, thank the love to everyone. Love to Spirit. Thank you, Spirit. Mm-hmm. Thank you, Mother Earth. Thank you. Thank, thank all you. Of you for thank being you. here today. And um, thanks to you, uh, viewers, for helping us to raise a vibration today. We uh, yeah. appreciate it. Mm-hmm. Uh, thanks again. Mm-hmm. Bye-bye. Okay. Thank you. Light, love, and blessings.